Mr. Chairman, ladies and gentlemen, good morning. It's very good pleasure indeed for me to be able to attend this meeting. Today, I would like to present my paper, the single detection method in OSN based on distilled and double SN LSTM for tax analysis. In the first part of the report, let's think about three questions. First of all, initially. What is a single attack? A single attack was originally used to describe a form of attack that acts on a P2P network. For example, when a tanker uses a single node in a P2P network to push multiple identities, we can network redundancy, reduce network robustness, and interfere with normal activities. Secondly, why single attack? can be implemented in OSN. OSN services are generally implemented as open access systems. Open access systems try to provide their services to as much users as possible without verifying the identities of users during registration. OSNs are open access systems due to a variety of reasons. Users may not be comfortable sharing sensitive information like social security number through third-party services. Also, keeping such sensitive information about the user is dangerous and prone to information leakage. Since many security mechanisms are based on the assumption of new identity, an open access system doesn't follow these assumptions. Simple attacks are made possible on Western services. Finally, what is a single attack in OSN? In a single attack, a malicious entity tries to multiple fake identities, which gets registered for services of OSN. OSN service considers these single identities as real identities, even though they are in control of a single malicious user. These single nodes are then used to influence tasks which require collaboration from a multitude of nodes in the network. Examples of such tags can be voting scheme, collaborative spam detection, etc. Then I will introduce our contribution for three aspects. First of all, we propose an end-to-end -end classification and a detection model based on the content posted by users. This method avoids the highly user friendly features of carefully forged symbols, which not only improves the classification accuracy, but also reduces unnecessary expenses. In addition, the proposed analysis model uses, uses uh, bi directional encoder representations from transformers, which is the bird model that have outstanding performance in natural language processing tasks for tax analysis. At the same time, we consider the timeliness of word and the compares and shows it optimized distilled version of word, called the distilled bird protein model. Moreover, to fully consider time features, the time series association between each text content is extracted through the two-layer long short-term memory with self-normalization on a model, which was proven to be effective. Last but not least, based on the tweets regarding the 2020 U.S. presidential election, we contrast the dataset with the real accounts and single text. This dataset contains 222,802 tweets related to Biden or Trump during the election of the U.S. president from October 15, 2020 to November 3, 2020, in which there are 949 real accounts and 987 symbols. The dataset has now been published in the GitHub Open Source Warehouse and it can be used by relevant researchers for further analysis and research. And then, I will introduce our dataset construction method in detail. 
The baseline data set in this article was derived from Cargill's public data set. The first one is the U.S. Election 2020 Trace data set, which provides a, pro a total of 1,727,003 trades with Donald Trump and Joe Biden as relevant hashtag during the U.S. general election from October 15, 2020 to November 3, 2020. The second data site is political trace with Twitter both data site which provides a total of 198,550 political relative trades issued by rubles during the U.S. general election from October 19, 2020 to November 3, 2020. And with the two data sites, to contrast a positive sample, we manually selected 987 singles from the public data site tree. And to contrast a negative sample, considering the public data side one must include rubles and symbols, we firstly deleted all the data of users whose username matched the username of rubles, and then deleted all the data of users who matched rubles in the published trades. Furthermore, the number of trades published in this time period needed to be exceed 10 to meet the experiment requirements. Finally, a total of 949 negative samples were obtained by manual scaling. Then it comes to the manual check, we consider the static information such as personal information, including the number of friends, the number of likes, the number of followed, profile, etc. Whether the content of trades is abnormal, trade frequency and the content repetition, whether it has been officially suspended, whether it is marked as a robot account in the known blacklist. The judgment provided by other plugins such as both sites and both scenario is used as a reference. The following figures shows many details of our data set. Next, I will focus on our system side. Our system has three layers in total. The base layer is data processing. And the second layer is sentence embedding. The last and the last is classification layer. As a data preprocessing layer, we need to determine the maximum number of trades of each user and the maximum length of each trade. Then we need to normalize each trait, that is to replace all links in the trades with a, a unified form of HTTP column flash flash U. And then we need to include them into the tokenizer of this two bird for word segmentation and indexing. And finally, we need to build it up to the maximum sentence length with zero. And thus, it is necessary to use mask to distinguish between the field part and the data part. As the sentence embedding there, we need to convert a fixed length sentences expressed in the form of a word index value into a vector uh, with a fixed dimension through this two bird. The distilled bird model uses knowledge distillation based on bird model to achieve a faster, lighter, and very simple model to the original model. Knowledge distillation can be understood as a method that enables a lightweight and compact student model to learn a more massive and excellent teacher model. When bird and distilled bird are trained in the teacher student structure, the distilled bird simulates the output distribution of bird, and distilled bird can learn most of the experiences of the bird model. Experiments show that the number of parameters of distilled bird was 30% less than that of the bird model, but it still retained 97% of the performance. And the embedding factor 
Master Wu understands and extracts the sense, semantic features of the task, as the input of the classic field model helps the classic field model achieve better classification results. Then we choose the uh, first particle CRS output by the model as the input of the classification layer. This is because the CRS as the starting tag of the text doesn't correspond to any word in the text. Finally, as the sentence embedding layer, we need to use a um, BioLSTM model to extract the terminal association between each text content. The output of the last LSTM learn in the network is the sequential input of the job log layer, the fully connected layer, and the neural whose activation, activation function is sigmoid to output the classification result. At the end of the report, I will show you our comprehensive experimental results. For the selection of classifier, we choose common RNN models for comparative experiments, including simple RNN, GRU, LSTM, BILSTM, double LSTM, and the double SN LSTM. And the evaluation indic indicator of the class here includes the confusion matrix, post alarm rate, precession, recall rate, occurrence rate, and the air under curves. Of the 70 reports, the indicators of each class here stabilized. The value of each evaluation index on the test set is shown in the table 1. From the experimental results of the sentence binding through this two birth, the above RNN models then the semantic features and mutual relations of sentences very well, and they give correct judgments. The loose curve of each class here on the training set and the validation set is shown. We can see the double SN LSTM performs best. Following figures show the evaluation index curves of each class here on the training set. And that is on the validation set. It should be noted that the experiment used a 5 flood cross validation method to divide the data set. And it took the average of five results obtained in a run as the output result of the report. Finally, I will make a conclusion. In this article, we proposed an end to end model based only on text content analysis to detect symbols in OSN. That is to detect such accounts only from the behavior level. Static account information and social network relationships delivery contrast by an attacker will also affect the detection results of the method. And thus, it can better detect the symbol accounts that are carefully forged by the attacker. Moreover, we contrast a new data site that is more suitable for the text analysis for other scholarships to use. And we use this bird to extract the semantic features of the text for embedding, which can better reflect the semantic features of the text compared to other embedding methods such as word wake and blob. After comparing experiments with various uh, recurrent neural network models, we decided to use the WSN LSTM as the classifier. From the perspective of evaluation indicators, our model and methods have a high detection rate for symbols. Finally, our future work will focus on how to integrate structure-based features with their content-based features to achieve a more in-depth and uh, comprehensive detection to deal with the attacker's con constantly changing bypass strategies. Thanks for your time and attention.